What's going on YouTube? My name is Diesel and today we are back in Scrap Mechanic Fan Creations! Fan Creations! Yes, we have six, count them, six, six time, six creations, all from the same gent or lady. I'm not really sure. I'm not really sure. It's from Stellated Hexahedron. It's quite the name. Uh, he doesn't uh, have a YouTube channel or anything uh, in the email, um, but uh, if you want, let them know some love for all six of these creations and all varying different creations. And I think uh, y'all are going to enjoy them like the first creation. Uh, oh, 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 I want to. <laughs> it's a crab. It's a crab. It's a king crab. It's fantastic. Show him some love. Hit that like button. You know what I'm saying, player? This is some good stuff. Stepping his game up. All right. A little switch in this. A little switch in the center. That gets him walking. And if you want to turn a little bit, it takes a while, but the king crab, it does turn. Ever so slowly. Ever, ever so slowly. <laughs> but it is spiffy. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's it's definitely creative. You know, use, useful? Not really. But, awesome, all at the same time. I like it. So they did Hexahedron, uh, he's really, uh, he's showing, showing off his skills there. Yeah, walkers are really complicated for me. I don't know what it is. I don't know if I can, uh, I can do it. But Diesel will walk sideways. Yeah, crabs walk sideways. You ever, you ever see a crab walk forwards? Then that, that crab is a weird crab. Stay away from that crab. Stay away from most crabs, because they're dangerous. I'll tell you what though, he is missing the pinchers. He's missing the little, little clamp clampies. Little claws. He's got the legs down. Need some claws. To the next creation! Our next creation, same guy, stellated hexahedron. This is number two of six. It's pretty fancy. Something that I have always had trouble with, and that's a biped walker. It's a robot. Whoops, gross. It's a robot, and it's called Murgatroyd. Oh, I'll say it again. Murga, Murgatroyd. Now, it is a freeform uh, standing robot. Can't really do two cr. Oh, what's this? I didn't notice this before. Oh, this must be his ride. <laughs> Doesn't turn. Doesn't turn. <laughs> anyway. Murgatroyd! All it is is one button, and then he walks. Oh! Murgatroyd's got a gangster lean! <laughs> I, like how, I like how his arms swing. I'm just walking to luck. Just going to the store. Just trying to get some, uh, just get some things that I need. Mm -hmm. It's gonna take me a little time. I like his back too. Make it looks like circuit circuit boards. It's pretty funny. But yep, all it does is walk, and that's all it needs to do because it's fantastic. He's adorable. That's what it is. <laughs> just watch me with my gangster lean, gangster lean. Watch, watch my gangster lean. Oh. <laughs> dun, 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 hey, all right, very cool, American tried. I do like his arms when they swing back and forth. That's pretty fancy. <laughs> to the next creation. All right, third creation, and probably I think one of the coolest ones. No offense to all the other creations that he's made. Um, he's made an elevator, and it's a spiral elevator. Um, you're gonna see a bunch of lag coming up here, uh, because of the, uh, the twisty little pieces. These are actually just wedges. They're wedges and they're wedged together. They're wedges and they're long and they're strong and they're down to get the friction on. So, ladies, yeah, ladies, yeah. No, uh, it's a spiral staircase and it's powered, spiral elevator, if you will. Spiral elevator and it's powered by these joints right here, I think. Hold on. Is this the wrong one? Wrong one, wrong one. <laughs> There's two of them. And it's uh, two electric motors. Uh, they have the uh, controllers here. I think he has a bunch of controllers to have these. Uh, have the spiral. You know what I mean? But hop on in, and it, this will take you up. Now the lag is real because of all the different wedges that he's used to go up. But if you just keep going forwards and backwards, the elevator will take you up. Uh. 
This delayed hexahedron apparently likes all his creations to have some sort of sideways kind of uh, kind of vibe. You'll find out about that. I mean, the, the the crab goes sideways. Here you have to go sideways, and another creation coming up soon. You'll see that you have to go sideways as well. But the lag, the frames are a little much. So it doesn't really seem like it's a, a viable thing in survival or even in your creative world, obviously, because you won't be able to do a whole lot because now I can't feel my face because I'm so frozen in time from all the frames. It's smooth, I'll tell you that, but it's slow. <laughs> but very cool creation and awesome, awesome job. This is pretty cool. <laughs> to the next creation! Now, this next one, he calls it Pythagoras. It's a long-tailed reverse turtle. His shell is on the inside. It's got a little hard shell in there. He's got six sensors. Now, there, are, there is no seat, because what this guy does, he's your buddy. They'll just follow you. That's what I understand. Unless I broke it. I, did I break it? Gotta help it to break it. Did I break it? I think I broke it. Boo. There we go. Kinda. Hold on here. What's the problem is? Oh, there we go. If you stand just a little bit further, he follows you. He's like your buddy. It is, it can, it seems like it's a little, like it needs some work. But if you just stay in a nice little center there, if you move over to the side, he will then move to the side, and he'll follow you like your little buddy. Like your little Pythagoras turtle. Turtle. Turtle, turtle. Turtle, turtle. Now if I go over here, does it wag the tail? What does it do? Okay. Okay. I don't know if that, I don't know, does it tail wag? I can't really see it. Who cares? All you, all you need to do is put a little face on this bad boy, and you got yourself a little buddy for life. I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. Come on, buddy. Come on, guy. We're off to our next creation, Pythagoras. Come along. Come along, Pythagoras. You are mine. You are my buddy. I will love him and call him and call him Pythagoras. <laughs> Very kind. Of, that's pretty cool, though, man. I think I think there's a couple applications you could use for this. Um, I mean, he's got the sensors all the way up to 20, so I mean, it's not like. I mean, one he could probably turn off all the little button sounds, but I mean, other than that, um, maybe for an idea of like walking a dog on a leash, make like a fake leash, but make it a you know 20 you know certain amount of uh, area away. So that that way, when you're walking, you constantly stay at a certain pace. But the thing is, is like you can't really like hold on to a leash unless you're like, you can't really control a whole lot unless you're uh, you can't really hold on to stuff. You know, like I can't grab this with my hand because I, mean, I, have, I have tiny little hands. But I think it's a pretty cool idea, pretty cool concept. It'd be better if we could ride it though. I want to ride the thing. I want to ride him on to victory. Or on to the next creation. Now, I have a question for you. All right. Have you ever wanted to possibly launch into the sky, but without the use of, say, a car or a thruster or a rocket or a buddy hitting you with a hammer? Like, have you ever wanted that? I have. And now it is possible with the spring launch. Say what? The spring launch. Oh, <laughs> pardon me. That's a little dookie. Alright, check this out, man. He's got... One, two, three. Three sets of... It's like six springs loaded, ready to rock and roll. It's attached to this board right here. And then this uh, comes on up. These arms come up. It brings us down and shoots you up into the air. Let's do this. Whoop. Come on. Oh, oh, shizzle. <laughs> oh, we could use this in something. I think we could use it. I mean, you could use this as an elevator. Elevator? Who, need, who needs Who needs a scissor lift? Who needs a scissor lift when you got when you got your own spring launched way to get up to places? That's pretty cool. 
Now sometimes the arms get stuck onto the I beam and you gotta hit it with a hammer. But you know what? Small price to pay. To launch you and yours up into the air with the greatest of ease. I'm gonna do it again. Woo! That one wasn't so hot. That wasn't a hot one. Let's do one more. One more hot one. We're playing with fire. So hot. Down and up we go! <laughs> Oh, oh, see. No, no, okay, we're fine. We're still good. 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 Come here. Woo! <laughs> very, very cool. To the next creation! Now, our final creation is an automobile. And it's an automobile that is thinner than its tires. And it works, it doesn't tip over. And if it does tip over, it doesn't matter. You can drive it upside down, because it's uh, it's uh, pretty flat. Now, of course, it's only if you don't mind having dirt six inches away from your face. It's the Ambicar. Now, I don't know why he calls it the Ambicar, because it, maybe it's probably because you uh, may have to go to the <laughs> to go in an ambulance to the hospital after you're done. Check this out, man. This is a pretty wild design. All right, so we got an engine over there. We also have an engine over here, because uh, there's uh, six tires. Um, one engine can only go to five tires. So, you hop on in here. You're going sideways. Don't worry, we got a roll cage. It's gonna be fine. Now we're going forward. And we're moving, we're grooving, we're shaking, we're baking. It's a good time, it's a fantastic time for everyone involved. Oh yes, yeah. so let's take this for a ride. I like it. Now I do have a question though. I want to, I want to grip it and rip it. Let's grip it and rip it. Is that what I have it up to? Is that what I have it up to? Do I have it up to seven? Yeah, let's put it up to seven. You never know. Never know until you try. All right, ready, set. I'm putting your creation to the test. Oh, baby. Woo, doggy. Let's do a flips. We're doing flips like a madman. <laughs> oh, yeah. This is a pretty sweet automobile, man. Automobile? And it flies. You don't have to worry about it. You don't have to worry about it. I mean, if it, uh, if it flips over, it's fine. We can totally let it happen. <laughs> awesome. Of course, it could use a little paint job, but you know what? That's something for your own creativity to take over and have yourself a good time. Indeed. Still, uh, oh, come on. Come on, ramp. We gotta hit this ramp. Let's hit this ramp. Let's hit this ramp something hard, something fierce. Now, once you get up to this speed, it's a little hard to control, but you know what? It's necessary. We're getting after it. We're getting after it. I can't control it. Crap. I can't control it. Let's go. Come on. Whee! All right. Just a good old boy. Can't really go straight at the speed. It's all over the place. And we hit the ramp like a monster. Oh yeah, what's up? <laughs> so very, very cool indeed, man. I dig it. Awesome, awesome stuff. Make sure you keep that creative juice, those creative juices flowing, and always keep coming up with some awesome stuff. Let's turn it back down to five. That seems like a safer, much safer. Much safer for a car where your head is literally uh, in a terrible, precarious place. <laughs> so folks, all of these creations will be down in the description down below for you to download into your world and have yourself a good time. And uh, maybe paint it up and uh, maybe use those creations uh, for some for some other world. I know that that spring, that spring is gonna, that's, that's, a, that's a dope. I like that spring loader. I like that. That one's my favorite. I love that one. This is pretty cool too. Indeed. I like it. Very, very cool. So, 
If you enjoyed this episode, make sure you hit that like button. It helps my channel out ever so much more than you know. And if you like these downloads and these uh, creations so much, make sure you leave a comment for Stellated Hexahedron in the comments down below. And also make sure you subscribe for more daily gaming videos and people on Skype are talking to me. Hi, hi, hi people from Skype. Hi, Skype. So, everyone, have a great day, afternoon, evening, good night. Peace out, like, shout, ciao, and I will check you out right here again in Scrap Mechanic Fan Creations. Fun creations next time. I want to go off this jump again. We're gonna do it. We're gonna get after it. Here we go. Ooh, boom. <laughs> All right. I hit that like a gymnast, and you have no way of knowing how awesome that was. That was pretty cool. I dig it. I like it a lot.